The Washington Post reports that the Obama administration is seeking to make it easier for the FBI to compel companies to turn over records of an individual's internet activity without a court order if agents deem the information relevant to an intelligence or terrorism investigation. The administration wants to add these four words, electronic communication transactional records, to a list of items that the law says the FBI may demand without a judge's approval. Government lawyers say this category of information includes the addresses to which an Internet user sends email, the times and dates email was sent and received, and possibly a user's browser's history. It does not include, the lawyers hasten to point out, the content of email or other Internet communication. Industry lawyers and privacy advocates see the move as an expansion of the power the government wields through so-called national security letters. These missives, which can be issued by an FBI field office on its own authority, require the recipient to provide the requested information and to keep the request secret. Stuart A. Baker, a former senior Bush administration Homeland Security official, says the proposed change would broaden the Bureau's authority. He said, quote, it'll be faster and easier to get the data. And for some internet providers, it'll mean giving a lot more information to the FBI in response to a national security letter. To critics, the move is another example of an administration retreating from campaign pledges to enhance civil liberties in relation to national security. The Obama administration has asked Congress to amend the statute, the Electronic Communications Privacy Act, in October.